Well, what's your name, sir? What's your name? Sorry. What's your name? Man, I don't answer questions. So what are you here for? Whoa. What's what you your visa? Where's, what's your name? I don't answer questions, man. Is it? Well, hey, in the courtroom, hey, that would be a different thing. Upstairs period, the judge's orders. I'm his bailiff. Right, yeah, but the judge has uh, power over the courtroom, man. Please leave my office. Is this a Please leave office? my office now. Hey, whoa. My understanding is a person is not filming in the courtrooms. Mm -hmm. They could film out here. Mm -hmm. Bring me to court, please. I'm not coming into court. Don't touch me, man. I'm ordering the security to bring him into the court, please. No, do not touch me, brother. You don't want to touch me. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is News Now Ninja. Today's video is for a channel that I've already given a couple of shout outs for that continues to grow and do excellent work every day, CH and Ty Audits. If you haven't heard already, CH was arrested and this is the most ridiculous arrest I've seen on the internet today. Not only does CH get arrested for contempt of court when he doesn't even have court this day, but he's told that he can record somewhere and then gets arrested for doing so. Get to the link in the description to see the entirety of this content and let him know News Now Ninja sent you. Also, don't forget to like share and subscribe while you're over there at his channel and let's get straight into it all right everybody ch and tie audits here today we are in newton county indiana i don't need any help today brother i just gotta put this here what's this for i just just uh there's no recording devices in the courtroom. Yeah, I know. Okay, let's record. Yeah. Can you get your coat? So what do I got? There we go. There you go. Again, there's no recording devices. In the oh yeah, I know, man. I don't want to go to jail. All right. No, it's judicial law. They don't have any recording devices. Well, it's, yeah, the, the judge could hold me in contempt of court. There's yeah. no actual law against the. The only law against that would be the First Amendment. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. No, no law shall be passed abridging the freedom of the press, except for when we find it necessary. Are you here for court, sir? I don't answer questions, man. What's your name, sir? What's your name? Sorry? What's your name? Man, I don't answer questions. So what are you here for? Whoa. What what's are you... your visa? Where's, what's your name? I don't answer questions, man. What's your name, sir? Mm. I'm just asking so your name. My eyes are up here. here. What's your name? Are you on this list? I are, don't, you, are you here for court? That's what I'm asking you. Sir, I don't answer questions. Well, what are you here for? Okay. Okay, folks, you What? What'd you say? Am I detained or something? No, let's come back here. Oh, uh, if I'm not detained, man, I'm good. Thank you. I don't answer questions, man. I asked him his name on the list and went down. Thank you for voting us. Have a good day. You doing all right today, man? I am. Good. I'm doing great, brother. Doing great. We got here. Communication Center. Hi. How are we doing today? I'm doing good. You can stay free. Because I, of course, I do. Can I get some kind of justice classes? I don't need any help. Um, what is what is this thing? It's places you can stay for for free. Is this like? Do you guys got homeless shelters around here or something? No, it's just we put up different clothes. Okay, okay, I got you. All right. You know you got people waiting out here to get through. <laughs> Good luck, everybody. Sir, we don't allow reporters up here on the second floor. What's going on? Turn the phone off. 
you have to turn your, we don't allow recording up here on the second floor, so you have to turn your phone off. Why not? Is that a law? Or? The, the judge does not allow it up here. Right. She's court. got power over her courtroom. I'm yeah. not going to go into her Wait, courtroom. We don't. Okay. But we don't allow it, so I'm going to ask you to step down here. Man, as long as I'm not in the courtroom. They don't allow it on this floor. Right. There's no law, dude. So if you're not allowed to do it, that's you. But I'm a citizen. I have to follow the law. Mm -hmm. Only charge that I could be charged with is contempt of court if I go into the courtroom. Okay. So the law says that the judge can do that. The law doesn't say anything about me not being allowed to practice my constitutionally protected activity on the second floor of a courthouse. Do you get what I'm saying? I understand what you're saying. Okay, well, then that's good. So let's just cut out the whole trying to give me unlawful directives, and I'll just go about doing my business, and I'll get out of your hair when I'm done. Yeah. All right. Thank you, man. Metal items right there for me. No, I, I'm not interested in going around to where I am going to get a... In trouble, man. I could be over there. It's not in there. It's office. That's that's an office. That's an office. It's a what? It's the office for the administrators. So there's like court records and stuff in there. Okay, good. That's actually what I'm looking for. So. Uh, is that like the supervisor of the bailiffs over there? Shelly? Yes. Okay. Awesome. What's going on, man? How's it going? It's going good. Are you do you work here? What are you doing? What are, you, what are you doing with this? Didn't they say no cameras allowed up here, do you? Um, Nobody? It, well, hey, in the courtroom, that yeah, would be a different thing. Upstairs, period, the judge's orders. I'm his bailiff. Right, yeah, but the judge has uh, power over the courtroom, man. Please leave my office. Is this a Please leave office? my office now. Hey, whoa. Hey, Don't Jason. you get all crazy with me. Yeah, what do you well, mean, hey, get we're this we're guy out of here? Are you guys going to go hands-on and get a lawsuit? Yeah. You guys are going to go hands-on? No, we're not going to go hands on. I'm just asking you to leave politely. Well, he wasn't, man. Do you want to apologize to me and I'll leave? Come on. I'm asking you to leave. If you apologize for raising your voice, I'll oh, leave. Oh, yes, thank you. You apologize? Yes. Can I actually hear it? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, great. Okay, good. Thank you. Yep. I mean, just being polite, man. That's all you need to do. The jury room. There you go in there. I was just in that door. They, they're not letting anybody in there. The judge Leach does not allow recording on this floor. The judge has got power the over the courtroom, man. They don't want recording on this floor. That's so. fine, man. I, the, the judge has got gonna, power. I'm just going to ask politely, politely to just leave this floor. If you want to record downstairs, you're more than welcome. I, I'm more than welcome to record up here, man. I, I don't care what the judge wants, man. She's not the law. She he, enforces it. It's he, you know. What the judge wants, that's what he wants, man. But what I want is my constitutionally protected activities to be secured. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? First I Amendment, no law shall be passed or bridging the freedom of the press. Mm -hmm. So as long as there's no law against it, I'm going to do it. Now, in the courtroom, mm -hmm. the judge's got all the powers that he, she wants, you know, whatever. You know, I don't know. Okay. But, you know, he can do that in his courtroom. He could hold me in contempt of court. You guys could ship me off to the jail. But up here... Mm -hmm. There's no such thing as contempt of court house. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to try to tell you, boss. Are you the guy from downstairs? Yeah. There's... Please tell me there's somebody down there watching the door. There is. There's no okay, thank God. Deputy. Thank God. Great. Off duty deputy. All right. Man. Okay, you're not. Are you allowed back here at all? No. 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 What's going on me? back here? Nothing, but you're not allowed back here. Okay. Superior Court Office. Sir. So we just spoke with the judge. They just had a conference that talked about this matter. Okay. okay, so they're looking into some issues and they just ask that you hang tight on the landing until they check into it. I also talked to their okay. there's no videotaping when there's voting going on. Gotcha. So, there's no videotaping of the voting. Of the, the, when there's so voting. There's, there's, that's I'm, not right, man. All I'm asking, they're checking into some restrictions. All that's right. Fine, man. They just ask that you hold tight on the landing until they're able to verify and they're, then, they're, then we'll let you back up here. They're gonna verify it, man. It's fine, unless I'm breaking a law. Where, I'm, all I'm doing is I'm politely asking you to wait on the landing until you. they check into. I think he's the got it. Do you guys get it figured out back there? 
this is this is the judge. I this is the judge. You treat him with respect, please. Oh, I treat everyone with respect till I start getting disrespect to myself, man. What's going on? How's it going? Keep telling me what to go. No, I have no problem. There seems to be some misconception that you know you judges can just kind of make rules for the whole courthouse. And I was trying to inform them, you get to make your own rules for your courtroom. But as long as I'm not going in, not filming in, there's not really a problem with me being up here. Because the First Amendment, as you know, there shall be no law passed abridging the freedom of speech. I'm very, I'm sure you are, but you know, this is this is their problem. I don't have a problem, man. I know, I know my laws. I know my rights. I can't go in there. I mean, I don't agree that you should be able to hold me in contempt of court for doing a First Amendment protected activity, but. That's the way. I mean, you guys throw people in cages for it, so I'm just going to stay out of there. I don't like going in a cage, so I'm just going to do what I can do here. You know, I got rights. If you don't use them, you lose them, right? My understanding is a person would not film in the courtrooms. Mm -hmm. They could film out here. Mm -hmm. Right. I think for security reasons, I don't want to be there or the jury room. Yeah, no jury rooms either. But as far as here, that this is an open area, that's what it's before. Okay. All right. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you. That's a secure area now? Yes. Okay. Yeah, we don't want don't to interrupt any of those matters, man. Sorry? What do you mean, like here? I am actually, Judge. I'm, a, I'm allowed to film right here because... If you film this, I will hold you to rock in court and... You can't hold me in contempt of court when I'm outside the court, man. I'm not coming into court. Don't touch me, man. No, do not touch me, brother. You don't want to touch me. If you touch me, that's going to be a lawsuit. That judge is ordering you something. You should not do it. He's. I haven't even done judge. anything illegal, man. I'm leaving. Come on. Nope. I'm leaving. I don't have to be in the courtroom. Guys. All right, everybody. At this point, the two armed thugs are ordered by their master to go hands on and drag a man into the courtroom against his will. At that point, this judge decided that he wanted to say that this man was in contempt of court for taking pictures in public outside of the courtroom. Not only that, but with a little research, I found out that they're keeping him in his cell for 23 hours a day, only allowing him one hour a day outside of his cell. His wife has already requested a video chat, which they denied, because from what I've heard, they got pretty physical when they took him down. Along with that, I've heard that he's been threatened that they are going to add felony charges of resisting. He's already been in jail for two days. Days, which means that there's been 46 hours locked in a cell. Not only that, but I've been told that he was advised to say sorry to the judge or he could add an additional 30 days. Tomorrow, CH and Thai Audits has court. And from what I've been told, either he's going to say sorry to the judge or he's going to stay in the dungeon longer with no bond. Let me know what y'all think about this video in the comment section. To see this full video in all of its entirety, get to the link in the description and let them know in the comment section News Now Ninja sent you. Also, remember that you have the right to redress. All the original links will be in the description and I'll see you on the next one. For those of you that stuck around to the end, check out this audio of me making a phone call to ask questions and them admitting that they're trying to force him to say sorry for exercising his rights to take pictures in public. Hello? Hey, how you doing? Pretty good, pretty good. I was just trying to obtain a little bit of information. I was seeing if possibly you could help me. Okay, so I'm calling him uh, uh, pertaining a specific individual, and I was trying to find out specifically what his charges were. Do you have a name? Yes, sir. What's the name? Okay, and you're trying to see what he's here for on? Yeah, what's, what's the charges? Is that what 
Yeah, he's getting on contempt of court. Okay, so is that the only charge? Yes. Okay, so there's no additional charges as of now? No. Okay. All right, and is there any updates of, uh, do you know when he's going to have court or anything like that? Uh, he's just serving five days and then he gets released. Serving, he's just serving five days, then he gets released? Yeah. Okay, because I had heard that uh, he had court tomorrow. And he's only been in jail for two um, days, so that's kind of. I believe he's going to. Uh, yeah, I believe he's going to court tomorrow to possibly uh, perjure himself on the contempt. Which basically, he just goes and apologizes in front of the judge for what he did, and then he gets released. Okay, so if he says sorry to the judge for taking pictures in public, then he'll let him go. Sorry to the judge for whatever happened. I have no idea what happened. I wasn't there. Okay, yeah, I mean, it's just what he, it's what he was doing. He was just taking pictures in public. Okay, so um, I understand you weren't there. It's not your thing. Uh, okay, so essentially he's being given the yeah, chance to go in front, he's given the chance to go in front of the judge to perjure himself and say sorry, and then they'll let him go. That's what you're telling me? Yeah, that, that's how I understand it. <clears throat> okay. And then if he doesn't perjure himself and say sorry for exercising his rights, then he just sits the no, five days. The five days I believe. Okay, so they're not going to add to the sentence or anything of that nature? Um, that's between him and the judge. So the, ju I, so the no, judge I could... So, so the judge could still add time, possibly? Uh, well, I'm sure if he goes to court tomorrow and does something to get charged with contempt again, he could probably get more time out of jail. What if he doesn't say sorry? Would that be considered contempt? Uh, you'd have to ask an attorney. I have no idea. Okay, because it seems, seems like, you know, contempt is like anything that could hold up the judge from getting the job done, you know, from delivering his justice. And, and if he doesn't say sorry and the judge considers that holding up his justice, then I feel like he could just say contempt again. That's all, folks.